Hey everybody, this is Ori from Master Web, and today's video is here to answer a lot of your guys' questions about how to embed the Shopify Buy Now button on a Shopify site. So we've made a video that a lot of you guys have seen, and it's how to make a Buy Now button and then take that code and embed the Buy Now button on another site, for example, a WordPress site or another platform. But there's a continuous uh, question, which is how do I embed it on my Shopify site? Um, so here's here's the video. Okay, so first of all what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to my back and I'm gonna create a new buy now button and I'm gonna for example create a collection uh, Just for example click here Select this uh, one. And I'm just gonna customize it. Let's say this is my my style, right? So I'm gonna go here and um, Let me just customize this. Let me just change the price just just for just to show you guys Okay, so now now let's say I change this. This is the style I want. I'm gonna click here on next and I'm gonna copy my code. Now that I have the code, I need to go to embed it. So what do I do this? Depending where you wanna put it, you're gonna put the code here. So let me show you an example or two. Uh, let's say I wanna embed it inside a, a blog article. Maybe I wrote an article. For example, I'm gonna take this sample article right here and I'm gonna, th let's say this is the article, just for example, let me show you. This is the article, second article, and it's just some, some demo. Let's say I wanna put the product right below this section. So I'm gonna go here with the cursor and I'm gonna hit enter and then it'll be right here. And then I'm gonna click here on the code, the show HTML icon. And I'm gonna go here and I'm gonna basically put it at the end. And I just pasted that code that I just copied a second ago and I'm gonna click on save. Now when I view this page, you'll be able to see this is the page right here. One second. Let me close this for a second. Let's try that again. Right here. So I pasted it and let's look at it right here. Okay. Now that you see that, now I have my, my button right here, right? So that's it and it works. Add to cart, it'll open and that's it. Now I embedded it. So this is, for example, in an article. Now let's say you want to put it, I'll show you another example or two, you want to put it in a product description. Okay, so this is my uh, product, for example, and I can go here and the same thing. In my description, I can click here on the code and I can go to the bottom and I can just paste it and then I'll click here and do that. Okay, and now let's look at the preview. Okay, so let's click on preview and here's the button right here. Now, when you make changes in Shopify, you change anything, there's some kind of caching happening. So sometimes you have to wait 10 or 20 seconds to do that, and then everything will appear. But actually, it appears already here. So that's it. Now I have it here, and now I have the Buy Now button here as well. The other uh, thing you can do, which uh, if you're not a developer, you shouldn't do, is obviously you can go and you can input that code in your theme code. But obviously, you'd want a developer. So I'd go to my theme, I'd click here on Edit Code, and then figure out the place I want. Uh, and this is for another topic for another video. I'd put it in, for example, I want to put it in my theme, for example. I'd put copy, paste it, and that's it. It's just HTML, right? It's just JavaScript, HTML, etc. So that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any more questions, let me know. Thank you guys. Appreciate it.